A personal services contract is a contract securing the performance of certain services or talents by a particular individual. In CNA International Reinsurance Company v. Phoenix, we explore what happens if that individual dies before fully performing his or her contractual obligations. Actor River Phoenix and his mother Arlen Phoenix owned Jude Nile, a corporation. Nile entered an actor loan-out contract with Scala Productions, under which River was to appear in a movie called Dark Blood. The contract contained a general clause stating that each party would refrain from doing anything to deprive the other of the agreement's benefits. Nile entered a similar contract with Geffen Pictures for River's appearance in a movie called Interview with the Vampire. Before the completion of either movie, River died of a drug overdose. The production companies had entertainment insurance policies that covered such a scenario, Scala Productions through CNA International Reinsurance Company and Geffen Pictures through American Casualty Company. After paying out on the policies, the insurance companies acquired any associated legal claims held by the production companies via subrogation. The insurance companies filed suit against River's estate, alleging that River breached the respective actor loan-out contracts by consuming fatal quantities of illegal drugs and thus depriving the production companies of the benefits of their agreements. Arlen, as the executor of River's estate, moved to dismiss both claims, alleging that because River's death rendered performance of the personal services contracts impossible, the contracts were dissolved and there could be no breach liability. The trial court granted the motions to dismiss, and the insurance companies appealed to the Florida District Court of Appeal, arguing that impossibility due to death doesn't negate breach liability if the contracting party is at fault in causing his or her death.